Hey everybody, Todd Bartusik with Berkshire Hathaway Real Estate and the All Metro Real Estate Group. So coming to you again with the market report for June. Okay, so we had a drop in unit sell from 35 down to 23. So that's a drop of about 34%. Uh, doesn't necessarily surprise me, uh, you know, because the summer gets going and people just get busy. Um, we had a price point overall drop of about almost 5%. So we went from 385 down to about 366. Um, but that means we had some lower priced houses um, than the month before, because we're still generally seeing, you know, especially the starter price point, those houses are up. So that's District 66 across the board. So again, average sale price down about five and a half percent. Um, now our move up, or excuse me, our first time home buyer price points, that's three, that's zero to 350. That uh, we saw drop there from 25 units down to 17. So that was a drop about 32%. We went from 257 to about 278. That's up 8%. So that's that starter price point that's really driving the market. Um, and then what, it, what happens is the first time home buyer price point will push everything. And we went from eight days on market average in May to three in June. And we had multiple offers in a lot of the houses in Westside. So again, you guys, the, the demand is there. So whether or not you're a buyer or a seller, please pay attention to these statistics so it can help you you know, whether you're a buyer or a seller. And if you have questions, obviously call me and ask me because um, there's gonna be differentiators based on condition, based on where the house is at. Um, just really, there, there's some factors um, that are gonna make a difference on whether or not we're seeing an increase in um, appreciation or if we're seeing depreciation. So that's the starter market. Then our move up is 350 to 750. And we saw units sell, I mean, we were down one. So we went from six in May to, uh, to five in June. And we went from an average sale price of about 537 in May to 562 in June. So that was up almost 5%. Um, now again, that first time home buyer price point was up 8%. So that starts to drive the whole market. So that was the, that was the move up. Then the last segment I always like to talk about is the luxury. That's 750 and above. So we had four sell in May for an average of 955, and we only had one in June, um, and that sold for 825. But that house was listed at 815 and sold for $10,000 over list price. So again, you know, at the end of the day, the demand is still there for Westside. Um, and if you are a seller, we need to get listings out there because there are buyers. And if you're a buyer, really need to pay attention to um, you know, what's the condition of the property? Because uh, if it's all dialed in and, and it looks really nice and it's mechanically updated and things of that nature, more than likely, there's gonna be multiple offers on it. Um, so if you guys like what you see here and you find all this information, you know, useful, please remember to follow me on social media and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.